everyone welcome to vidhigya explain series the topic for today's discussion is neet that is national education alliance for technology scheme so first of all we will discuss why to this topic is in news so neet that neet first of its kind government scheme set in motion over 2 years ago has finally taken shape bringing courses offered by a group of edtech platform within the reach of college and university students from socio economic disadvantages background so the process started in the year 2019 and it has finally started it has finally started showing results and or you can say it has finally started being implementing implemented in 2022 so first thing you have to remember started in the process of this started in 2019 so this is why this topic is in news it started around somewhere 15 january this was in news so the the idea is that through this scheme the courses will be offered by a group of edtech platform within the reach of college and university scheme from socio economic disadvantages background so about the scheme the so national education alliance for technology is implemented by all india council for technical education so first thing you have to remember neet this need is different from this need national eligibility come national this is for medical entrance test so this is different this is need national education alliance for technology is implemented by aict that is all india council for technical education it aims to act as a bridge between edtech companies academic institution and students it acts as a bridge between edtech company and academic institution academic institution and students so there will be neat scheme so through neat scheme this edtech company and academic institution and student will be connected so the initiative was taken by ministry of education by ministry of education this is an important fact that you have to remember it realized that learning tools developed by edtech platforms that can be supplement that can supplement classroom teaching need to be more more accessible so ministry of education realize that there are certain there are certain tools devel, tools developed by edtech platform developed by edtech platform that can supplement classroom teaching and therefore they need to be made more accessible to people so accordingly it was proposed that a portal be created where edtech platforms can be roped in to display their product after a short listing process this is a simple thing so the products on display in neat portal So this is important. So the NEET portal has separate sections listing products for students and educational institutions, institutes respectively. For example, there will be separate list here for students. Products for students will be listed, and here for academic institutions. So this is how it will be there. So the companies were short listed. So companies for NEET portal will be short listed by an independent expert committee, so that there is no corruption, nepotism, and favoritism. so there are two categories one is b2b b2b and one is b2c b2c that is business to business and business to consumer so under b2b segment of the portal courses are on offer for higher educational institute to purchase in bulk for their student so under b2b the courses are offered to educational institution which educational institution can can purchase in bulk for their student and under b2c section list courses that eligible student can borrow through and choose from so under b2c section list under b2c section list courses that eligible students can borrow so there are two types of list and two types of category that is b2b and b2c the courses ranging from accounting and finance to coding including advanced program languages like python so there are different plan, different courses including coding and languaging like c c++ and python and all so how it will it benefit students from backward community that is the important thing so in order to do that the government has mandated that every short listed company will have to offer free coupons to the extent of 25% of total registration for their solution through neat portal so for out of total registration on neat portal for an edtech company 25% will be free and in a type of coupon so there will be coupons so through this route the government created a bank of 12.15 lakh free coupons over the last two year so through this government has created around 12.1 lakh free coupons free coupons 10.5 lakh free coupons 
so and now it has now started distributing those coupons among students belonging to sc st obc and ews category with annual family income cap fixed at 8 lakh rupees so these coupon will now go distributed by government to people belonging from sc st obc or ews category people provided that their families and annual income is annual income is less than 8 lakh 8 lakh that is 8 lakh per annum less than so this is the criteria so we have discussed what is need it the process started in 2019 started finally in shape in 2022 by all india council for technical education ministry that is ministry of education there will be we have discussed two lists one for students one for academic institution then we have discussed two categories one is b2c and another one is B2B. And then we have discussed how go, how this will benefit, how this will benefit backward communities. So the 25% seats will be reserved, or you can say 25% seat will be given as per coupon. So the coupon will be distributed by government to these people whose family income is less than 8 lakh per annum. So this is basic information. This is all the factual information that is relevant for your CLAT examination. So just mug it up. So that's all. So now we'll discuss five important questions related to this topic that can be asked in exam. So question number one, NEET is an initiative of which ministry? So which ministry? Your options are Ministry of Education, Ministry of Home Affairs, Ministry of Social Justice and Empowerment, and none of the above. And the correct option is Ministry of Education. Question number two, the process of NEET program was started in which year? In which year this NEET program was started? Your option are 2019, 2020, 2021, none of the above. The correct option is 2019. Question number three, NEET is being implemented by which of the following? Your options are AICT, that is All India Council for Technical Education for technical education and then second option is bar council of india third higher education funding agency funding or you can say financing agency and option d none of the above the correct option is all india council for technical education question number four the support to students from socio-economic background socio-economic backward background students whose family income is less than which of the following so the support to students from socio-economic background whose family income is less than which of the following so government so the question basically saying the government is providing through this scheme the government will provide support to people belonging from sc st obc ews category people provided their their annual family income is less than your options are 10 lakh per annum at 15 lakh per annum 8 lakh per annum none of the above correct option is 8 lakhs per annum question number five the government has mandated that every shortlisted company will have to offer free coupons to the extent of to the extent of percent of the total registration for their solution through need portal fill in the blank your option are 50%, 25%, 15%, none of the above. The correct option is 25%. So here it will be 25. So we have discussed all the factual information related to this. We have also discussed how this platform, how this program will work and what is the aim of this program. So that's all for this session. Stay logical with Vidikya, your best pal in CLAD preps.